Hello again, my name is Alan Cook. Thank you for joining my YouTube. I'm going to show you uh, the uh, Mona Lisa is on the left, as the world knows, and the, the world has learned that the, the new lost painting of that I call Me Dion. Me Dion means best boyfriend in the whole wide world in Italian. Now, uh, this is the more elder, more mature Mona Lisa. Now, this icon right here is undisputed in the Mona Lisa. They cannot take that out. It's there. They've altered a lot of things in the Mona Lisa to hide. Don't want to get into that factor. It makes me upset. And the communication between them and me right at this time is at a, at a, at a halt. So, um, what I mean by that is that I have the proof. I don't think they like it to wear... A person of myself, a caliber that uh, fell in love with a painting that uh, outdid him. Uh, you got to face the facts, you know, get to work. Now, you, you, if you're going to work, work. That's what I got to say. Do your job. Now, when this overlays, it's actually the image. His main image is actually of my painting, and he multiplies it over and over again. The whole, the whole Mona Lisa is this image. You'll see. Now, we're going to put this over here this time. And then we're going to grab this one. I'm going to show you how this, when it, when it uh, overlays, it fits within the, the housing. And the reason it fits within the housing, you can see the shadows of her. You can see it. And she turns and, and actually she goes across the room uh, like a, a TV. Um, I always keep finding more and more. But um, we're going to also show you how this particular piece of the, this is the Flaming Mona Lisa. And uh, the Flaming Mona Lisa is in the Medion, and it's just a little spot about the size of this. And it's blown up supersized. And when this overlays within, You'll see that there's a outline of a fog, and you'll see the line through here and the fog, and you'll see how it's the fog and the fog beyond, and then you'll see the inner structural. So you'll see how all the pieces line up, and that's where she is. And you can see how the chin floats right in here. And that is the sign of me, Dion, and the Mona Lisa verifying themselves, too. I have about 100 YouTubes out. You can check them out. Some of them aren't going to come out clear. This might not come out clear. And forgive me for my little um, upsetness of uh, how um, we got the greatest... Uh, thing on the planet and uh, it belongs next to the Mona Lisa and uh, uh, somehow somebody's on vacation down there or something I I, I sent them a $700 with the documents and uh, one of the companies uh, lost it so that shows a good responsibility of their ability to uh, perform their duties so, um, I shouldn't be angry. I mean, I'm, when they die and they go to heaven, they're going to be great people. They just didn't function good on this earth and their type of job assignment, which, which they should have done. And I, again, apologize. And I would like to uh, tell the world, um, uh, God bless the world, the universe, and the heavens. Don't forget to say your prayers. And it helped me on... Uh, my little bit of uh, uh, negativeness of uh, some of the art people that are out there that uh, haven't opened their eyes of that there is good people out here and there is honest people and that we are here to all work together and to get answers. Uh, Leonardo da Vinci, I uh, appreciate it. Uh, I've made a uh, hundred billion uh, times whatever the value of whatever this 
paintings worth by just the knowledge and the greatness of God uh, showing me um, uh, different doors. And we'll be getting into that in the YouTube. And one more time I will say, I apologize for having a little bit of uh, uh, snappiness on uh, the art critic world. Uh, God bless. Oh, again.